my principals, teachers, uh, chaplains, educators, youth leaders, I thought I'd make a really quick intro video and tell you guys a little bit about who I am. So my name's Alana Bosgra, uh, I'm in my 20s and I'm a practicing visual artist. I also have a social science background in human behaviour uh, and at the moment I'm doing a master in mental health and art therapy. So basically in my own art practice, uh, I love to talk about issues that not just young people but all people face um, at different times in their life, whether that's anxiety, depression, uh, bullying, self-esteem, identity issues, um, trying to find some sense of meaning for our lives and hope. These are all things that I talk about in my art practice and that I'm really passionate about speaking about. Uh, and in my art, I do very colourful pen and pencil sort of work and it's quite quirky and surreal and it, it usually kind of puts a spin on how we'd normally see things and it, um, it's just sort of a different way of looking at things, I think. And I love to speak in community groups, so I love to come and share my story and um, share a little bit about how art is a really, really healthy, cathartic way to get out how we feel and sort of look at our emotions and understand ourselves better. Um, so in schools, I generally bring all my art equipment with me and I run a really interactive, fun kind of workshop. Um, and it's, I like to think it's really enjoyable and fun, but also it does tackle sort of the more serious issues as well. I've also spoken in groups like retirement groups, so I do tend to jump around and speak in quite a, a diverse um, range of settings. But I'm really passionate about speaking about this and sort of raising people's awareness about art and mental health and the things that we go through. So at the moment I'm based in Brisbane, I do love to travel and I have gone to every state for my art workshop. So I am pretty keen, if you're interested, um, send me an email and I'll send you through my prospectus of um, my speaking and what else I share, a little bit more information. But I would absolutely love to hear from you. I would love to come be part of your community. I think I offer something different, being that I'm not that much older than the kids I often speak to and they're not often expecting it to be from a personal perspective that's sort of quite a different angle. So I think I could offer something valuable and I'd love to hear from you. Thanks.